Our MSC for Social Development in Mpumalanga, Lindy Wench Alinjali, is demanding 200,000 rands from the DA for defamation of character. Now, this follows a long court battle between herself and the DA, alongside former councillor at the Amalasleni local municipality, Naritha Naidu during her tenure as the executive mayor. Now, the DA accused Njalinjali of flouting the Municipal Systems Act and giving salary increases to her former executives in the municipality, amounting to millions of rands in December of 2018. After the DA failed to give enough evidence to back up the allegations, the Whitbank Regional Court ruled in Njalinjali's favour, ordering the DA to pay her 200,000 rands, including costs. Therefore, we took the matter to the regional court in Whitbank. We are happy that uh, it has concluded its business, that uh, on the 22nd of April 2022, an award was granted, that all the allegations and information that was circulated by the Democratic Alliance tarnishing my name in terms of paying senior managers the salaries, it was incorrect. They circulated information without sending it, and it has discredited me. And hence, the court said it granted me a relief that they should pay me about 200,000 and with the cost and here we're trying to teach uh, every person, every political party, every community member that don't circulate or tarnish or perpetuate uh, allegations that are unfounded because it tarnish us and we've got families who are leaders and if it goes unchallenged it means it's the truth. Nowadays we've got these things where when you should be deployed or you must hold a position they will tell you that you should step aside. Hence, I took an initiative to go to the court and sue them. Now the court has granted me a relief and I'm happy and it's a lesson to all other communities or parties to say don't circulate information that is not checked, that is not truthful and don't tarnish a name for political reasons. Hence, here we're saying the court has expressed an opinion and further, there are reports that have been leaked prior to our provincial conference Friends, where it says the section 106 of Emalakeni on the same matter, I should be taken uh, for opening up a case. And we're going after the COCTA department also, the same process to say they must prove beyond reasonable doubt on the wrong that we have done. Where we are, the court has relieved us, and their prior decision of your labor court where the matter has been resolved and we've won three times. And we're not going to rest until our names are cleared.